it is time to meet your spirit guide I will guide you through an astral projection experience where you will then find your guide in the spirit realm so please ensure you are very comfortable in a place where no one will disturb you for the next hour or so take a nice slow deep breath in feeling your body expand with air and as you breathe out let yourself sink even deeper into the mattress and you may have closed your eyes already but I'd like for you to open them for a moment and look around at the physical world taking note of where the light is coming into the room if any light is present you can locate where the door and perhaps windows are if you happen to be outside you can see the nature around you allow for these beautiful sights of your surroundings to make your body feel more and more relaxed for you know that after this incredible astral projection session this is what you will see when you wake up now draw in another long deep breath and when you breathe out let your eyes close and then as you breathe back in open your eyes slowly opening and closing your eyes aligning with the breath breathing in open breathing out close this is a very relaxing task and you may find your eyes are getting a little tired and they want to remain closed but keep opening them as you breathe in a few more times and I will count down from three now and on three you may close your eyes and keep them that way three two and one you can close your eyes and notice how good this feels and even though your eyes are closed you can remember what your surroundings look like how the light was coming into the room exactly where the doors and windows were and you even remember the textures and colors of the things around but now that your eyes are closed you can use your imagination but first we are going to get even more relaxed to do so 
become aware of the skin that is exposed to the air. Your skin automatically notes the temperature of your surroundings. And now, drift your attention over to the parts of your skin that are covered in fabric. Perhaps you notice the warmth of your clothing or covers. Now back again, noticing the air. The cool areas on your skin. And returning now to the warm areas of your body. This is very relaxing. It's also nice knowing that no one will disturb you. This time is for you alone to explore the astral realm. You are in for a treat. And if you've practiced astral projection before, you may know about the energetic phase. This is where you notice your own energy It can be in a color or a texture, but just begin to notice what your energy feels like. Tiny vibrations, tingling, You may be a person that sees their own energy. What does it look like? You may be someone that just knows their energy. Be with your energy now. Place all of your attention on your own energetic field. Taking note of where your energy feels different in different areas. You may even feel a lightness or perhaps a gentle heaviness. Now, without moving your physical body, imagine you are just turning your head from side to side. Very tiny movements, but don't actually move your head. Just imagine you're moving your head. Imagine that you're moving your fingertips. Just small movements with the fingers. Without actually moving any part of your hand. Simply imagine you are. Very good. 
you are beginning to feel your astral body. Let's go to the feet now. Can you just imagine you're wiggling your toes without even moving your body? Perhaps you can even imagine moving your ankles around from side to side. Now, focus on your whole body. Yes, it is hard to imagine the whole body at once, but you can do it. What may help is imagining that you are on a gentle canoe and the water is gently rocking your entire body back and forth. Feel your whole body moving ever so gently back and forth. feels really good to imagine floating in a canoe when in reality your body is just laying on the bed relaxed and this gentle canoe gives you an easy rocking sensation that is quite pleasant. Your astral body is moving from side to side. Very good. Now, allow your creative imagination to imagine instead you are swinging in a hammock. Your body is cradled by the ropes and it is swaying in a gentle warm sea breeze back and forth. A little more movement than in the canoe but it's ever so gentle. This is your astral body enjoying this hammock. For your physical body is just resting, but your astral body is on a vacation, swinging back and forth in the hammock. And as you rest in this hammock, just imagine you're slowly lifting one of your arms up, opening your hand and waving at a cloud passing by. Ever so slowly, feeling your astral arm waving at a fluffy cloud. and put your arm back down. Very good. And I wonder, with your astral ears, can you hear the sounds of the ocean? The gentle waves crashing on the sand one after the other. You can even hear the breeze moving the leaves of the trees around.
And do you remember how you felt your skin earlier? Let's feel your astral skin now. For your astral body is in the warm, sunny breeze. You can feel the beach air on your skin. Very good. It is so pleasant imagining being in a hammock by the beach. And it is also pleasant imagining you are floating in a canoe, gently rocking from side to side. Just as it is very relaxing to notice your body physically resting, perfectly comfortable. Totally undisturbed. Feel your back fully supported. And can you notice your astral energy? Your energetic field. Imagine now that you are just sitting up in the bed. Your astral body is moving, but your physical body remains still. Your astral eyes are open and you can see where the door to your room is. Now get up from your body and we'll be back later. We're going on a little adventure. Stepping out of the bed Imagine you can feel your feet on the floor. In the physical world, things are known. You know your home and you know what is outside. But you are in the astral world now, a different place. Your room may still look the same. But let's go to the door. Open it and step through. You find that you're still at home. Things look to be pretty normal. Go ahead and make your way to the door outside. And as you go to this door that is very familiar to you, You notice that the door handle has changed. It's quite different. Reach up and grab it with your astral hand. And you open the door and find on the other side a beautiful garden. You are surrounded by flowers big and small. You didn't know that a garden could have this many flowers. There are orange flowers the size of basketballs. Pink flowers the size of your pinky.
blue flowers cover the ground. Instead of green grass that you're used to, it is just a sea of blue flowers. As you breathe in slowly through the nose, the sweet smell of the flowers goes into the nose and travels up into your head, filling your mind with all the creativity that is natural for you. Breathe in this delightful smell. You are enhancing your creative imagination right now. It is very powerful. As you slowly walk through this sacred garden, you are letting go of anything that holds you back. Yes, it is true. Anything that holds you back is just melting away. All old memories that you don't need anymore are being removed. Any tension in your body is being released and you are allowing it to go. This is a sacred healing garden that will take care of any emotional wounds. The sunlight comes down and shines its nutrients upon any emotional burdens that you've held on to, no matter how far back they go in your lifetime. The sun in this garden is healing these wounds for you and you have been waiting for so long to heal. Wonderful. Now it feels like you're walking on air. You have let go of so much that you almost feel like you're nothing. Just pure consciousness. When you are coming to the edge of the garden now and you see before you a magnificent ancient forest. The trees are as big around as a car. And though they don't grow very tall, they are extremely wise. You make it into the shade of the forest and a cool, crisp feeling comes over you. You can feel the moisture in the air that's being held in by the trees. You are walking towards a giant oak tree. 
It is the biggest one in the forest. And as you draw near, reach your hand up and place it on its smooth bark. You have connected to an ancient wisdom. Listen and hear the messages. The branches of this ancient tree are growing very close to the ground. They are easy to climb. So you begin with curiosity to climb this magnificent tree. And it seems you are more than welcome to. And as you climb from branch to branch, you see up above you a light coming down through the leaves seems to be located at a source that is much closer than the sun so you are climbing towards this light Branches are so sturdy under your feet as you climb. It's almost as if it was made for you. To your surprise, there is a massive tree house built at the top of this tree. You've made it to the treehouse. You see that inside, that bright light is shining out. There is a little door that leads inside. Reach for the door handle with your astral body. Opening the door very slowly. That bright white light is almost so bright that you can barely see. It is radiating your entire spirit with love and compassion. Your eyes adjust to the light and you can see inside there are two chairs very comfortable chairs. Make your way over and have a seat in one of them. Your spirit guide enters the room Notice how they appear for you. They seem to glide across the floor, making their way to the other chair. As they sit down before you, you can sense that they have been waiting to speak to you for quite some time. Simply enjoy their presence and listen to anything they need to share with you. It 
feels so nice listening to your spirit guide. It seems they are speaking to you in a way that feels so natural, like you've always known them. Your spirit guide has a gift for you. They reach down beside their chair and pick up a small box. They reach out and hand you this box. Grab it and open the box. What do you find inside? This special gift may represent something for you, or you may not understand what it is. Either way, your subconscious mind knows exactly what it's for. Now is your chance to ask your spirit guide anything you want to know. Go ahead. Very good. Your spirit guide holds their hands in the prayer position and gives a bow to you. They say that you will do well in your life if you only take the steps towards good and love. You feel a deep sense of wholeness, as if you've been waiting your whole life for this moment. Your spirit guide rises from the chair and floats away from the room, vanishing into a bright white light. You find that you are relaxing in a treehouse that can oversee the tops of all the other trees. Look out the windows and enjoy this magnificent structure. And then you feel another presence enters the room. 
you turn around and see that it is you, your future self. Your future self begins to tell you that they are the combination of good choices. You see that they are radiating good health, happiness, and overall joy. Your future self begins to show you in pictures and images how to live your life in the best way possible. You see stories playing out within your mind of talking confidently in all situations. You see times of laughter and joy with your family and friends. You see that you are financially abundant, always having your needs met and more. You see in this future life that you exercise regularly and love it. You make good, healthy choices for your body and for your mind. In this future life, you are successful. You are free. You are living the life of your dreams. You can even witness the beautiful home, car, and family. Whatever your dream life looks like, you are being shown by your future self. Enjoy this moment of pure beauty and truth. This is your future. And your bright and shining future self walks towards you and extends their hand for a handshake. 
you oblige and as you do you begin to melt into the same person soaking in all the knowledge it takes to be this happy and this healthy You are now one with your future self. Take one last look around the magnificent treehouse and then exit out the door. Begin your descent back down the ancient tree. Each branch is firmly supporting your weight. You are holding on to memories that you will never forget. You've made it to the forest floor, placing your hand back on the tree once again to feel its beauty. And saying goodbye, make your way back out of the forest and into the sun. You find yourself back in the sacred garden filled with flowers. Even though you let go of so much before, This garden is taking away even more of what you don't need. Old negative self-talk is fading away forever. doubts that you can live this dream life are being removed. Any stagnant energy that still remains is vanishing. Even the cells within your body are being completely renewed. Enjoy this garden for a few moments longer, letting go of anything that has been holding you back.
you find the doorway to your home, reach up and grab the handle, opening the door and stepping through. Your home is familiar. Everything is just as you left it. Make your way slowly back with a new fresh mind to your fully rested body. As you enter the room, you see an ever so gentle smile on your face as you are just so relaxed in your bed, fully rejuvenated. Have a seat and roll back into your body whatever way feels right for you. Begin to slowly breathe in and breathe out fresh new oxygen as you reorient yourself to your current surroundings and the physical realm. Breathing slowly and deeply, begin to wiggle your toes ever so slightly. Yes, moving your physical body. And move your physical fingers just how you normally would. Move your head from side to side. Take a deep breath in and open your eyes. Notice how your surroundings are just how you left them. Take a deep breath in now and feel a deep appreciation for this experience today. Bring your hands into the prayer position and say, I am grateful. You may return to your day feeling refreshed or simply drift off into a deep and long sleep. It has been my honor to guide you. Namaste.